We did it for you. Here's what you need to know with Amy and Sean on 1027 VGS. Wild scene on the campus of UNLV yesterday. Several people spotted a coyote trotting across the quad. That's scary. Mm -hmm. uh, that is about six and a half miles away from the nearest, like, hey, no one lives here anymore area, which is, yeah, yeah that's a long, long trip. That's, there was one in our neighborhood um, a few years ago when we were in Summerlin and it was in our park, just in the neighborhood park, just yeah. walking around and, but we're obviously closer you to Red Rock. There. Yeah. Like Mountain's yeah. Edge, I've seen it like near the uh, Poppy's frozen yogurt. Mm -hmm, like that's about mm -hmm. a quarter mile away from the desert. Sure. Yeah. It's still so scary. Like even if Roman's like playing out back with his trucks by himself, like part of, like I'll make the dog stay out there and, and babysit. Yeah. <laughs> Nice. <laughs> Good parenting. Follow me for more parenting tips. Yes. Those are called <laughs> the dog snacks. Will watch. <laughs> Those are coyote snacks. Oh, my God. But it is. it, it does freak me out sometimes. Video of it at uh, 1027VGS.com. When you do see a coyote, by the way, it's kind of like seeing a black bear. You must get big, make yeah. noise, and try to scare the coyote. Wait, can you do that? I can. I'll try. You try. Yeah. <laughs> I'm an apex predator. In yeah. real life, it'll be like, oh my God, babe! <laughs> <laughs> I'm so tasty and delicious because all I eat is crap. Yeah. Uh, the snowpack number is at the upper basin, still above normal, still slipping a bit, though. The uh, latest number from the Bureau of Reclamation has snowpack numbers at 133% of normal, which is great. However, back in January, it was 150% of normal or so. So it's shrinking, but it's still good. And there's more snow to come to the Rockies, which is a good thing. We should know by early April whether or not we actually are in the green this season or if we slide again. Uh, CCSD just approved zoning changes of several schools. We told about this last month. Uh, elementary schools in the Inspirata area are going to be affected. Coronado High School in Green Valley High will see changes. A whole bunch of changes in the Northwest for kids going to Indian Springs that live in Centennial Hills. That is quite the trip. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, Fullest can be found at 1027VGS.com. One thing you note, though, if, you're in a, if their kids are in a middle school or high school, they're already enrolled, they don't have to move. This is going to be for newly enrolling kids and for and kids entering ninth grade next season. Th this will affect them. Yeah. Um, that's a good thing. Knights had their nine-game point streak snapped last night in a 3-0 blanking against the Colorado Avalanche. The Knights are back in on town tomorrow night for a game against the Hurricanes. Uh, speaking of, maybe you caught the Golden Knights on AT&T Sportsnet. Chances are you won't say that much longer. Their parent company, Warner Brothers Discovery, has announced they're getting out of the regional sports network game. And according to Wall Street Journal, the teams, they have 10 teams in total, mm -hmm. Golden Knights, most important to us, have the right to transfer their contract, no cost or anything, to another broadcaster by March 31st or risk their games not being broadcast at all. <laughs> uh, that would mean at least four games in April would have no local TV provider. That's ridiculous. Yeah, that's yeah. that's so bad. And I was going to say, though, but like, are the nights even being broadcast? Because we never get to see any of the games. Well, and that's it's the thing. The worst. If, you, if, you, if you don't have Cox, it's like you're probably not seeing it. It's mm -hmm. just, it's it's a tough network to get. I'm not impressed by the network. I love the talent. I love Dave Gosher. Yeah. I love uh, Shane Knighty. I love the on-air people. And mm -hmm. luckily, I believe they are all employees of the team and not and employees the of the network. network right. Uh, but yeah, they, I mean, uh, here's what they got to do. Just call it a day and have the team itself be the broadcaster and let us just tune in and watch it. You can mm -hmm. sell ads against it. Be beautiful. Yeah. I hate these blackouts. They're so stupid. Yeah. I want to pay you. Let me pay. I'll pay. Mm -hmm. Just let me see the game.